It's me, Tori Mac. Long time no talk to. I miss y'all so much. I say that every time. All right, today is my six month surge anniversary. I gotta do this video driving because I never get to do videos either. I have been sick. Um, my six months haven't gone so well. So I'm either sick in the bed or that's about it. That's why I haven't been doing videos. Um, I had my surgery September 13th. I weighed 256 pounds and I can't look at the camera because I can't drive and look at the camera. Um, and I weighed 256 pounds. Today I weigh 174 pounds. I'm excited. Um, it's kind of crazy. I mean, I look crazy. Y'all can't even see a little bit. A little, little, little tiny bit but um it's crazy being this size i don't know how to act i haven't really been able to appreciate it because i haven't been feeling well i i got irritable bowel syndrome after i had my surgery so i have a lot of intestinal issues and a lot of pain in my pouch a lot of times so that's what I'm dealing with. Tomorrow I'm actually going to see a specialist um, uh, in my state and he's from out of the country and he's supposed to actually be like an expert on what could possibly be going on with me. So y'all pray for me. Pray that it goes so very well. Pray that I am officially healed. I've actually had a great week. Um, I've been to work all week um i won't go tomorrow because of my appointment but i'll go friday prayerfully and you know it's it's been a long road but it i just have to i keep trusting in god that it's gonna be well that i'm gonna be well all is gonna be well and i won't have any regrets I can't say that I haven't had any regrets. There's been many days when I'm rolling around in pain that I say to myself, I hate I had that surgery. Now, I ain't, I ain't even going to lie to you. It has. But I, like I always say, I own what I do and I chose it. So I'm not going to gripe about it. And I knew, I knew it was come what may. You know, it's risky. It's a risky surgery. Um, for those newbies know that everything don't always go according to plan so you just have to be prayed up um, you have to trust in the God that you serve or whoever your higher being may be and and go for it if it's something that you really want to do um, thanks to everybody that has known my condition and has prayed for me thanks for all my new subscribers i love you all and i just like to say a happy surgery to my surgery twin to shauna hey girl happy surgery uh you are doing it and i'm proud of you and um this is a quick update i made this video because she threatened me on facebook that I better make a video today. No, she didn't say that. She just asked if I would because she missed her Southern Belle. So here I am. Um, what else do I want to talk about? I don't know. My wedding is coming up um, next month. I'll be married April the 9th. I'm excited about that. I had to postpone it a little bit because I was under the weather. Um, and that's pretty much it. Uh, my job... I work for the best company ever. Um, I miss like a whole month of work. And um, I've been there this year, make 15 years. So I am very thankful for that. They didn't give me the boot. I actually start a new position on Monday, which I am so excited. I needed a change. And that is my testimony. Sometimes God will put you through things because he knows it's time for change in your life. And he knows, he knows all. So he knows the reason why I had to have complications for six months. 
and I just trust him and if I hadn't gone through this I could have been stuck in the same dead end position that I've been in for 15 years so everything happens for a reason and God is just so good to me y'all I mean it don't even make no sense sometimes that it, it just sometimes like I said on Facebook today y'all can follow me it's Tori Bush on Facebook um I said sometimes it scares me how good God is to me and that's true I, I'm just nervous because no matter what I go through he always has a plan when he closes one door he always got a better door open for me and and I just love him for that all right I ain't gonna preach y'all no sermon I'll do it but I ain't gonna do it today um what else my oh i haven't been able to go shopping so i've been wearing these big clothes um i went shopping yesterday this sweater i got on is a medium these pants i got on um they're a 14 petite or because i'm short i'm on like five three i feel like a midget now now that i lost weight i feel retarded i feel like a little small midget it's crazy and um I bought some some black um, dress pants that's a 12 because the position I got is a lot more professional than the one I had so I got the rocket I got to wear some cute clothes y'all so I'm so excited y'all know I'm still I ain't changed ain't nothing changed I'm still me I'm still random as ever still crazy as ever sorry about the lighting Oh well. All right, let me do a few shout outs. And if I miss you, please, please charge it to my head, not my heart. Because look, I'll be taking it some sort of way when people miss me. Like Ashley, my homegirl, I was like, she giving shout outs. She better say my name. No, I'm joking. But I was happy that she said she wanted to see a video from Tori Mac. Uh, my sister Latanya, girl, you know I'm gonna shout you out, boo. I'm so proud of that Zumba. You go, girl. And Keisha, my other surgery sister, Angel Kirkland, NYC Chocolate. Oh my gosh, I don't want to miss nobody. Um, Lene, I I follow you on Facebook. I'm proud of you. Um, my sister Marlene, who pray for me like it ain't nobody's business she is the real deal holyfield let me tell you um lord i don't want to miss nobody but i um uh, my girl q that hits me up on facebook um inbox and i hope you are doing well i haven't heard from you in a while you need to send me an inbox when you get this video um what else do i want to say if i'm like i said if i missed you please don't please don't hold it to my heart because i love you i love each and every one of of, of y'all that follow me and allow me to be a part of your life um Grell and be gone she inspires me on facebook with those pictures she is just a beauty queen um who else i don't know i don't know like i said i've been working all day which is great um i'm on my way home now to pick up my children i don't know what we're gonna do oh let me talk about my diet a little bit i don't eat nothing let me tell you what i have found that i can't eat um, graham crackers when I was in the hospital one time one of them times um, I didn't want to eat my dinner so I started eating like the honey made graham crackers and my pouch likes those and my pouch don't like nothing I mean absolutely nothing and um, and also I eat chicken drumsticks that's it but the good thing about it is I don't have an appetite ever I never have an appetite. I don't miss food. The foods I used to love, I hate. Like pizza, oh my God, if you bring pizza anywhere near me, I'm about to throw up. And I used to get, sit and eat a whole pizza. I'm gonna keep it real. But I ain't eat a whole pizza, but I could have ate a whole pizza, like seriously. Um, Cause I love pizza like that. Like any kind. It didn't DiGiorno, it didn't matter any kind i just love pizza now i hate it so um right now my diet is very bland but i'm keeping my protein up i'm taking my vitamins 
and I take an array of medicine for my pouch, for my stomach and my intestines. So y'all pray that I'm soon to be off of medication, that I'm only taking my vitamins, and that I'm doing well. I ain't getting no high on the horse and like I did before because every time I make a video talking about I'm doing so good I have a downfall and I ain't doing it this time I'm taking one day at a time and today Tori Mac is feeling like Tori Mac so that's great I love y'all I'm happy that it's my surge anniversary and a shout out to all of my um my friends YouTube I love y'all all right, I'm going to go now before I make this video too long. 